Okay, guys. Bang San Tu, Con Ken. Uh, it's very quiet here right now, but two days ago in the middle of the afternoon, this place was packed. So much so I didn't even attempt to come down here. This is not an ocean. This is a reservoir. I've done a bunch of videos around here. I'll put them all in a blog post. I put the link in the video description. These are all restaurants, yeah? Your destination is on the left. My destination is right here. Look at all of this. Mm -hmm. Everybody's waving me in. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Go on, food. Come eat in my restaurant. Look at that, huh? everybody. I want to go and check out the restaurants, but I don't know. <laughs> I just had breakfast. I don't want to uh, buy food. Look out, buddy, you get run over. Ice truck right there. This is a good place for seafood. Always, these places are always uh, good for seafood. Uh, <laughs> there's so many of them, holy man. Look at this, huh? Ridiculous. <laughs> oh, look, there's one floating one out there. Look at that. I'll find somewhere to stop where I don't feel guilty and have to go buy steamed fish or something. It's going to be a difficult place to make a video. This is definitely a service industry type place. I drove as far as I could. I'll do a pan here. Some of these are very nice. Down that way. Really nice. Just seafood restaurants basically, without the sea, you know. Shrimp and uh, and fish. Look at that one out there. How cool is that, huh? It's got a flag for the roof. There's some paddle boats. Of course, I'm going to go see the fishing boat. There's a barrel rolling across the road over there. Wow. There's another ice truck. Fiberglass or fiberglass over wood? Yeah, fiberglass over wood. There's the gill net. Quite an interesting thing that one. Let's see how big it is. It's not monofilament, which is very surprising. Oh man, that mesh is small, huh? It's so small I can't even get it. Inch and a quarter, inch and a half at the most. Look at the pontoons on that one. Looks like a new design. Being, I say it's being built, but if you see that plywood, that's all flaked apart already. Plywood, this cheap, cheap plywood, the same as these seats. No good for nothing around water. It's made for one-time use concrete forms. This is interesting. You see how low the water is? Look where the floating dock is way out there. 
<laughs> Look at that old boat. I don't know if that's rooms for rent or restaurant. It looks like a restaurant in the top. Two of those. There's some long tail. There's a lot of fishermen on this lake. That's for sure. But these long tail. <laughs> There's no buffalo in the hole there. Hey, you be good. If you're scared of me, that's good. Look at these long tails. They're made of steel. All of them are. Huh? Really nice. Really, really nice. Especially that one. Painted up real good. The next one as well. Oh, one of the buffaloes up now. There's the highway. The main road that goes through. Restaurants over there. There's restaurants everywhere. You see, these are on pontoons. They're floating. Floating restaurants. Some of them are on pontoons. Maybe all of them are. I thought the ones we passed earlier weren't. This one's on barrels. Pretty cool, huh? Like I said, when I was here two days ago, every one of these were full. Unreal. Maybe today will be the same, I don't know. It's just middle of the week, middle of the day. Pretty cool, huh? Well, lots of garbage around, I don't like that. That should be a lot better. But yeah. <laughs> What a cool place to come. It's only an hour from Konkan. If you're in Konkan, it's a pretty cool place to come, I think. Great day out. Come for a seafood lunch. <laughs> Maybe even go have lunch on that one. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? More over here, huh? Lots over here. Uh, the restaurant style off the road. I can hear music and hear a motor puttering away. That might be just for electric, I don't know. It's gotta be self-powered. I doubt it is. I don't know how that works. But most of them is down this way. <laughs> so many. Uh, all this shade they got here for parking under, you know, Thai people Need to park their car in the shade. It's a good idea, but it soon looks horrible as the shade cloth starts breaking down. And, you know, it's poorly built. That don't look so good. It would look a lot better without it. Let's go take a look at this. This one with the orange roof and see if it's on pontoons. It looks like it's on blue barrels. Some of them are much nicer than others, but that don't mean their food is better. Most are thatched roof, huh? You look down there, there's a couple of steel roofs like this one. This one's half and half. Yeah, this is on barrels, but no longer floating. You could get the ones like this, you know. Not as cool as the floating ones in Loy. If you saw that video, that was pretty cool. That was really cool. Yeah, blue barrel, steel frame. Rather twisted. I 
This one's still floating. It'd be a full-time job keeping these things floating and in place, wouldn't it? As the, the level of the lake goes up and down. Because the water level can change pretty quick if they decide to release water for, at the dam, you know? It's not many barrels. Most of them are steel. And there's something that looks... Oh, there's square ones as well. Square pontoons. Okay. Yeah, pretty basic build, that's for sure. Nothing spectacular. That one looks cool. And it's floating. You can see it moving, huh? All right, guys, well, that's it. The ocean in Konkan. Good place to come for lunch, I think. And it's a nice drive up the coast too. That's what I'm, I'm doing a video, driving the coastline. That's a pretty nice drive as well. You get the lake on one side, the mountains on the other. Pretty cool. Uh, link to all the videos that's been done in this area, around this reservoir, is in, uh, in the video description. It's all in one blog post. All right guys, as always. Thanks for watching.